What's going on, Enigmites? We got a new video to check out tonight of a cryptid coming out of the Tongass National Park in Alaska. So let's get into it. All right, everybody, there it is. They're calling it the Tongass Dogman. I've actually just recently learned about Dogman a couple months ago, so I'm still figuring them out. So let's run the video real quick and let's take a look at this at the features. I took the sound out though because it was irrelevant. It looks like this was taken from some type of trail cam. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, that's definitely not a wolf. And the first thing that jumps out, two things that jump out to me right away when I look at this thing is it is its hands or its paws for lack of a better word. That's definitely not a wolf. That's definitely not a coyote. It's definitely not a wolf that has the mange or anything like that. A sickly looking wolf. The face is very human-like, I'll give you that. It's actually kind of kind of creepy the way that the eyes are spread apart as well. But we'll talk about that in a second. What I want to mainly focus in on is its hands at the bottom. It, it, if, you, if you see, it's got definitely four fingers and what it looks like a thumb going down the back side down there. I don't, I don't have my marker set up here. So it's got hands for paws. It kind of reminds me of uh, Professor Loomis from Harry Potter that when he turned into a werewolf. So, okay. All right. And it does have very human-like facial features. Let's run this video one more time. And let's see what we can look at here. Yeah, that is definitely not a wolf. Snout's too small. It's got a human-like face of some sort. Shoulder is not very wide. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's definitely odd. I'm not going to lie. That's a very strange looking thing. And I don't know what that is. <laughs> Just to be honest with you. I got no idea what that is. But I, we can rule out what it's not. Like I said, it's not a wolf. It's not a coyote. It's not a bear. Uh... Just like I said, this came out of the Tongass National Forest. If anybody's watching this video that has experience in that area, and you know what that could be, please let us know in the comments. But again, when I look at that face right there, that is, uh, like a lot, that's a little spooky, but that definitely has very human-like features to it as well. It's mostly the eyes for me that give it away. The eyes look like, uh, yeah, it definitely looks like it's probably a meat eater. But then when also when I keep moving forward here as well, get down to it, it's his hands. That's what I mean. It looks like a hand on his that that those are definitely fingers. In fact, I don't know any type of wolf or canine type animal. I can, I'm counting like one, two, three knuckles on each finger, and I definitely see the thumb to the back side and it definitely looks like it's got five digits in total i think the photo is legit because based on it <coughs> this was taken on a trail cam probably the shadow in the back is letting me know that it was probably le legitimate and it looks like it caught this this cryptid by surprise and uh yeah that right there is definitely something that I've never had any experience with. I've never, I've only been to Anchorage, Alaska twice. And I was just passing through the airport, really never been out in the wild out there. So I couldn't tell you. But anyways, fam, I'm going to go ahead and say that that's probably a legit cryptid. Now, some people, when you think of cryptid right away, you say that, oh, it's a, you know, a werewolf nut or, you know, some type of, you know, vampire or whatnot. That's not true. There's actually, you know, a cryptozoologist. They're finding all kinds of new species on the planet every day. I think they find, I want to say something like every year, I should pull it up, man. Every year they find 175 different species of something every year, right? This could be some type of dog 
out there. It could be something that we've never had any experience with before. Alaska is, is massive. And I don't know about this national forest. I don't know how big it is, but it's probably massive and remote. There's places in Alaska that you can only get, you know, by plane. And so this could just be a legitimate cryptid animal that we've discovered. However, the, the hands are freaking me out a little bit and the eyes are freaking me out a little bit. So, and the person who sent this, thank you for the subscriber who sent this to me. Uh, I'll send you a t-shirt. I'll reach out and send you a t-shirt, but they call it the Tongass Dogman, which make if you say that three times fast, Tongass Dogman. And I'm definitely could see with that face and those hands where they would get that. Anyways, let us know in the comments what you think it is. Please hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. This is a new type of video format that we're doing. We'll improve as we get better working it out. So, and also if you have any of these type of photos or any type of these videos, please hit the link in our description and email it to the page email, which is teampromeltv at gmail.com. And we will get back to you soon. Thank you. We out. Subscribe now and turn on the notifications to join us on this extraordinary journey into the unknown.